Hello, hello, lads and gals. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another mini update episode. And um, I feel like I've gotten quite a few things done this week. I finished to build the uh, more pack ogres from the uh, hunter and hunted warcry box. I also finished to build the maw pit and I have been painting up some of my warcry terrain that is from the Ooh, what was that box called? I know it was the one with drop my creed and horns of hashut I think they're called. But yeah. So I feel like I've gotten quite a lot done. This one is probably the one I got on <laughs> mostly done. Uh, I've done the bamboo. I've done the black leather under tree. And also the skeleton parts and the horns. I made the horns black. I kind of went after the uh, image on the uh, box, the box art. And I wanted to have a sort of uh, bone mashed with a bit of green in it for the bamboo parts. I mean, I've gotten the trees done, and uh, most of the bamboos, and skeleton parts. <laughs> They're a bit fiddly though, they like to get uh, hooked on each other. And there is also this little fence part. And um, also this the ruins. Might as well take one of these bigger parts. Uh, I noticed that they are. I don't know if I should say. Like a greenish blue. But. Uh, I mixed some of the speed paint into this and. Uh, I kind of like the look of it. Make it look different. And that's why I went with the same here on the stone that are by the posts. This one is mostly complete though. I just need to do the little tree branch and uh, then the earth beneath. And then it's done. Although these pieces are small and they're simple. And I also have this little room piece. Same here, went with that greenish blue and have done the tree parts. There are some bones and uh, stones around here. I need to do something about those. And then we have this little fence. Again, bamboo with that greenish, almost bone color and the skeleton. And on this big skull you can really tell that uh, it, there is different colors because there is no green in here, it's more of a brown. And then there is this big one with a big skeleton. Done all of the horn parts. I uh, guess we could go to the second camera, I think that would show it up better. And uh, zoom in a bit. I will run, run away. I don't have to plan it. I can go, change my pace. You won't understand it. All alone, that's okay. People like it. There we go. They don't want it. Yeah, so as I said, I have all the horns done. Take a chance. It could be possibly my last chance. 
on the spine. One of the horns are actually broken off from here. Kinda nice. And I feel like it's looking pretty good. I mean, it's just terrain. <laughs> so not really something that you need to have a lot of focus on. Yeah, here is one of those where I haven't done the skeleton parts yet. And here is the one where I did the skeleton parts. You can tell that they are similar, but not the exact same color. Like the bamboo and skulls. And we also have these rib cages. I like there are quite a few bone bits. Same here as those little horns. Losing time, I'm fading fast. I just want to make it last. Try to yeah. close my eyes and face the But this is going pretty fast, though. And I quite enjoy it. It's uh, quite relaxing, honestly. <laughs> And it's also nice to get the terrain done. Like, get it out of the way. And... With it painted up, it's quite enjoyable to play on as well. You get more color. So, yeah, that is what I have done this week. Oh yeah. I also did put some of the color on the bamboo on this ladder. Oh, circular ladder? It's more or less a um, bridge. And I also love the fact that it actually connects to the mop pit. Like it fits perfectly here. I think that was designed to work like that. So I need to build something with this at some point. But I think I will need to get myself some more bone primer. Because I feel like this small pit is gonna need it. As for the ogres though, I feel like I should go with like a light grey. Or should I go with the dead flesh? Ooh, decisions, decisions. I think the dead flesh would actually look pretty good on them. The one that I used on my tyranids. I might try that out. I'm not sure yet. Anyways, I think I'm just gonna end off this episode here and see you all next week. Hope you have enjoyed this episode and I hope to see you all next week. Until then, bye bye!